Hello there guys, Fengi here, and welcome back to Keta. So last time we rummaged around a lot of the houses, we managed to get ourselves an access to quite a few guns and ammo and other useful things. But uh, currently what we're going to do is we're going to check this jewelry store, we're going to check to see if we can find um, an electronic forge. We could just make one, but if we can find one that will be a bit better, plus... It's always nice to check out the jewelry stores around because there's going to be a lot of stuff like silver and gold that we can use for uh, crafting bullets anyway, so that's nice to find. It's not quite needed just yet, but we might as well go there since it's on our way to get to the electronic store, which I'm hoping will have some electrical books. Uh, we have access to a... we've got the integrated tool set, um, CBM, but I don't really want to risk a 40% chance of it failing, because they're quite rare to find. So, we'll leave it as... I mean, if I find a second one, then fine, I'll go ahead and try and install the first one. Obviously, if that don't work, then I'll save the second one so I go a bit more uh, thingies. So, we need to be careful, because there is turrets here. That's assuming, of course, the uh, other zombies and stuff haven't already took care of them. Is that what I think? Oh, hang on, is that... Was that the... Ooh! I think the wasps have gone. That's interesting, because the... That particular house, that particular spawn, has a lot of good stuff. And often, more than not, it will give you access to the uh, thingy books, the Rivtech books. Wow, if we can get one of those, that'd be fantastic. Yeah, these are all giant wasps. They've just died. Jedded. Let me actually take some of the stuff then. I mean, that's going to give us a lot of meat. So I may as well, I may as well uh, make, make make advantage of it, and I? The beetle's windshield is destroyed. Oh, no. Wow, really? Did I actually really do that much damage? Shit, that's pretty cool. Wow. That was a critical as well. Nice. Alright. So let's check this out then. Sloppy Joes. That's, they're, they're still fresh, really? Wow. Let's have one. <laughs> uh, wasp Sting. Apparently I've already... Cut that one up. Weird. We'll take the Wasp Sting now, and the Chitin. Now we need to be careful because uh, there might still be some... Ooh, tactical dump pouch and an... Uh, is that what I think it is? This is an aluminium keg filled with 50 litres of RDX and scrap metal. Contains a core of primary explosives to ensure that the charge is detonated completely and delivers its entire destruction power to anything in sight. Yeah. Should we take it? Well, we can. We should be able to carry it at least. But yeah, that, that's the first time I've ever found one of those just out in the open. Like, oh, you can take this if you really want to. Okay then. We still need to be careful though, because there might still be some wasps around. Judging by the look of it, though, there might not be. They've already been took out by the look of it, which is obviously a good thing for us. Because I haven't got to worry about it no more. You radiated tomato, beer, nothing else worth while grabbing. Well, I'll grab some rubber boots actually. We could use that to get some um, finger jigs. Now, really, what we should be doing is we should be doing this. Actually, we should be ripping the. Uh, oh, there we go. There's a giant wasp, which apparently we're dodging pretty well. Fantastic. Am I still getting? I was going to say I thought I was getting the dodge bonus from that. Then that would that would have been weird if I was still getting the dodge bonus. Oh shit! There's another wasp there. Wow, did I really just put... Wow. Just doing a nice critical. Yeah, I know. Don't worry about it. It's fine. I'm butchering pretty quickly now as well, thanks to this other knife, so... That's good. A pair of socks is ripped. How dare you. You bastard. Yeah, it's probably not worthwhile. Um, actually, this one here might be. There might be a wasp inside, but there might also be some stuff and there's not, so... Boo-hoo. Now in here, in here might be a different story. Oh, there's a downstairs. Now that's interesting. I've never seen a downstairs in this type of house. So I'm wondering what's going to be down there. I'm hoping there's some decent stuff. There's now there. Yeah, that's just uh, stuff. 
I mean, often or more often than not, there's often a lot of oh, ampule. There's often a lot of items actually embedded in the um, in the paper walls in the nestings, but. As you can see, we're not actually coming across any at the moment, which is really unfortunate. In fact, there's only a few things we've come across that's uh, unique to the uh, spawn, which is really unfortunate. I was really, really hoping for the uh, for the book that can spawn. There's a wasp in there. Yeah, I'm really disappointed by that. That is really unfortunate. Oh, hang on, what's that there? Oh, just root beer. Yeah, fuck. Oh, hang on, now that might be something. Oh, it's a messenger bag. <laughs> Great. Just what I always wanted was a messenger bag. Yeah. Yeah, that's really unfortunate. It's, it hasn't spawned what I've really wanted. Now, the ampule. Uh, what's, what's that do now? It's just. Yeah, it's just a jet, jet inject raid. A label on the side warns against using more than two doses per hour. Oh dear. <laughs> right, let's go and check downstairs and see what we can find. I'm hoping there's some special loot down here. Well, it's not looking good, so... Is this another... Oh my fucking god, we are getting so lucky with these. Wow. <laughs> Looks like there's no Zeds down here either. Oh, and this just went from being somewhat okay -ish to being fucking fantastic. More casings, I'll definitely take those. Let's put on my uh, military rucksack. Wow. <laughs> Is all I'm going to say. There's actually a wrench there. Let's take that. Put, don't really need it, but we'll take it anyway. Lots of ammo. Definitely. I don't even know what I'm doing. I can just press all of them instead. It would be so much easier. There we go. Lots and lots of ammo. So Even more 500 ammo there. Actually getting a nice supply of those 500 ammo, 300 Winchester, Magnum. Some really nice rare ammo types. This is fantastic, absolutely fa There's even some of um, the, the um, Riftech ones there. Wow. Now, more importantly, let's have a look at the guns. We know we've already got an AK-47, I already know that. We haven't got an Enforcer, I don't think. We haven't got a laser pistol. We've already got an AK-47. That's unfortunate, but, you know, we've got plenty of ammo again. So I'm not going to grumble at that. That's a nice find. Alright, let's just put all these. Wow, we had a shitload of these 20, 20 by 60s Load of different ones. Um, Hang on. Is one of the one? Yeah, one of the ones I've got is the uh, 200, isn't it? So if I go ahead and just do that. Um, 100 and... Just 100, actually. There we go, all the rest can be put away. The L39 is the 9mm, isn't it? Yeah, it is. So we can keep those there. That's fine. Is there anything else? There's a wrench. There's the ampule, which we might as well just keep over there. Actually, I'll keep that on me, if it doesn't weigh that much. And of course, the casings and primers. Root beer and chewy candies. There we go. Fantastic. Alright, let's continue our search. Well, obviously, we've got to try and grab our shopping cart first. I should really rename it. Uh, but for now, that's a good sign, and now we're at the jewelry store. Oh, what I'm actually thinking is maybe we can get through this entrance to the jewelry store. Might be a bit better. Possibly. Oh, maybe not. Actually, we can just walk in. Wow. Okay. <laughs> that's weird. Didn't think you could just walk in previously. I thought it was locked. On the negative side, it seems to be absolutely nothing here except for a couple of bits and tiddles. There's nothing on display. Absolutely nothing on display. Alright, now we need to check the back. The back is where we might find the um, forge. Holy shit, there is some cases though. We need the stethoscope. Fuck. So let me put a uh, safe um, S cyan. That's V dumbass safe. All right. 
weird. Is that is that that that's not all of it, is it? Shit. That's really damn unlucky. So yeah, this one wasn't really a very good um, very good one. But there is another jewelry store a store up there. So we might be lucky and find one over there instead. Let me put safe mode on. Spotted this oh now we spotted the fat zombies right there, I don't really care. Right, so there is turrets here. I mean saying that though. Um that's odd. It's saying there's a turret here, but has it really been destroyed by the Zeds? If so, that's fan fucking tastic if it has. I would have seen it by now, wouldn't I? If it was still there. What the fuck? So, right, let's start, stick to the road and just see if we can find it. That's really weird. I could have sw Huh? I'm so fucking confused at this point. Where's the turrets? Okay. Here's where one turret should be. Yes. Just go ahead and do that. Another fucking Zed. All I want to do is butcher. And you won't let me. Go away. No, it's fine. Okay, nothing there really to worry about, so I'm not really too fussed. This knife is pretty damn good, I must say. Yeah, it's exploded. Well, fuck me. Um, but these can use this. These players can use this one some decent stuff. Um, no, you were attacked by the feral hunter. Okay, kill the feral hunter then. There we go. Right, casings. Nope, 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 nope. Battery, I'll take the battery. So, was there no. There must not have been any. No, doesn't look like there was. That's unfortunate. That's very unfortunate. On the plus side, there's stuff here that might be useful. We'll take the leather jacket. We'll take the normal jacket. Morphine! Wow. Cool. There should be some dead bodies around here. It looks like the other two it's disappeared as well. The other two it must have. Um... Wow, there's a lot of zets around here though. Probably because of the noise of the turrets when there was uh, going. You know what I mean, don't you? Of course you do, guys. That's the one I just butchered. There's another Z here. On the plus side, at least this is helping me get my. Um Piercing weapons, but not by an awful lot because obviously I have um, there's a shocker Z somewhere. Oh, don't tell me he's near the fucking electric store again. I'd be a bit disappointed if he was. And I hope that shrieker zombie didn't shriek. No, he didn't. Good. Last thing I want is um, them knowing where I am. Spring. Hmm, what at the spring? Spring could be useful. We can make a uh, repeating crossbow with that. That's only I haven't. I don't think I've actually ever made one of those for um, any YouTube characters yet. Is the revolving, um, the repeating crossbow? We'll definitely have to um, see if we can sort that out. Actually, be really cool ceramic armor plate. Um, uh, can I make one now? I'm pretty sure I can. You know, um, I might have the. I might have the book back at home, and I don't know the recipe off by heart. Holy shit! An RM8. Uh, some of these, some of these I've never seen before. These must, some of these must be new, or at least they're that bloody rare that I've never seen them before. But that's that's really cool. Grenade launcher. Yeah, we'll take that. We'll take the riot helmet as well. I honestly can't see there's anything else. Around. I don't really want to spend most of my time. Oh, we could check the music store. I haven't even been in one of these yet. Okay, so we've got an acoustic guitar, banjo, ukulele. Let's take the I think we've already got an acoustic guitar, but you know what? Let's take another one anyway, just for shits and giggles. Is that a display case? Is there anything in the display case? 
I'm assuming not, <laughs> judging by the fact they will now wear items in a saxophone, another saxophone, a banjo, a pipe, a trumpet, some water, some more water. I'm not interested in sure what, why there's so many fucking rooms with water. Alright, oh, that's the outside, obviously. Is there actually anything else worthwhile? I mean, desk, display case, nothing in there, nothing in there. Actually, kind of disappointed. There doesn't seem to be much use for these except for getting a musical instrument. Hmm. You might have thought there might be some MP3 players or stuff in there, though, wouldn't you? You know? Bit weird. Anyway, what's this S1 here? Is that the spider? Whatever. Oh, it's a subway station. Okay. That was weird. So, here's the other jewelry store. We'll check this out. Let me go ahead and just mark those explored. But yeah, we'll definitely check this out and see if we can find what we're after in here. This one's open as well, so maybe there might not be anything decent in here. I could have sworn they used to be locked at one time. Maybe there's just a chance of it being locked. Got a load of pearl collars there. Yeah, it doesn't seem to... Oh, there's actually something in the display case here. Yeah, glass shards and earrings. Didn't even set an alarm off either. Bit weird. Right. Aha! Yes! Fantastic. Crucible, electric forge, hammer. Two hammers, in fact. Gold bar, solder. That's just what we wanted. That's uh, that's going to save us a lot of um, a lot of time now. Right, let's go with... Um, let me go with safe. Cyan. Um... Oops, would have actually pressed the right fucking button, wouldn't it? Let's save. Stethoscope. Oh, smoker. Let's not go that way. Probably hide in the pool. At least this is sorted now, so we'll put those uh, explored for the time being. Did it save the notes? It did save the notes. It's just being a derp about it. There we go, yeah, that's fine. Right, electronic store. Now we need to be careful because there was a shocker zombie close by. We have got ranged capabilities, but we haven't really got the ability to do any much ranged since, as you can clearly see, we uh, can't see very far. On the plus side, there's a lot of zombie action going down this way. Holy shit. Is that another shocker zombie as well? Good lord. Ah! This shocker zombie's still inside the electric store, isn't he? God damn it, we might have a problem here. Ooh. We might get lucky, and he might not just see us. That's what I'm hoping for. It's only a normal store. Oh, bollocks, that's a grabber zombie. We should be okay. Shouldn't make too much noise. As you can clearly see, we didn't make that much noise at all, so that's good. Cell phone, flashlight, hot plate. There's another zombie. Why is that one hiding in the corner? Holy shit, there's another zombie right there. We might be making a bit too much noise here. On the plus side, though, do I really. I don't know, I'm not going to bother butchering them. Yeah, they made a lot of noise in here by the look of it. At least we got one of the books that I was after. That's a good sign. Oh god, this isn't a very good sign at all though. There's a lot of Zeds in here. I really don't want to get too close, but... Right, let's see if we can go around the back of him. Oh, we can't. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! That's not good. I think he's, yeah, I think he's uh, lost track of us now anyway. That's kind of uh, helpful. <laughs> right, let's take that, take that, take the battery. Okay, there's actually quite a lot of stuff here. I'll take that. Signal receiver will take. 
that's it right now need to be careful I don't really want him to move too far away from there yes not that, you ninja <laughs> a uh, shocker zed Right, is there anything else that's going to be worthwhile checking out while we're out and about? The boxing gym actually might be. There might be some uh, books in there. I think we will check it out. See if we can learn some new arts. Yeah, the shocker zombie is not really uh, that much of a threat, so I'm not really too bothered now. Uh, okay, there's nothing there. Fantastic. Where's the door? Where's the door? It's right there. Hopefully no one's seen me. Oh, this looks like a different variant to the... No, it's not, is it? I'm being a dumbass. Right, let's see what we can find. So, is there anything on the... There's nothing there. Wow. A spring will take... Oh, hang on. The boxing one doesn't have any... Oh, shit. I don't think it has any... Yeah. We'll take the first aid kit, though. Obviously, that's a good... That's a nice one. And a leather jacket. Jesus. Definitely take those... Nothing else worth grabbing, I don't think. Off the top of my head. There's nothing else, is there? No. And these are just the showers, aren't they? Yeah, they're just the showers. Well, shower and toilet, I'm assuming. That's unfortunate. I actually might have thought there might have been um, some thingy books, but obviously there's not. Oh, well. Not an entire waste, though. More uh, first aid kits never hurt. Okay, there's two parking lots. Let's uh, go check them out and see if we can find anything with them. Don't, I really don't think the clothing store is worthwhile checking out, in all honesty. Um, is anywhere else worth checking out? I mean, obviously there's still the other houses we haven't checked yet. That one guy still has a few other things. Do you know what? There's actually nowhere else really to that's worthwhile checking. Doctor's office might have a stethoscope. Possibly. Should we go and check it out? Yeah, let's go and check it out. Grim Arrow, I don't care. There is a shock zone to the southwest. No, no big deal. Oh, we can go in straight away. Fantastic. There's probably not going to be anything good in here then. <laughs> By the look of it. That's a shame. There's nothing in there. Uh, there's a few axles. I mean, that's nice, I guess. Why a doctor's office would have axles in, I don't know. But I'm not one to question that. And cotton balls. Anything in the back. More bandages. Yeah, I'll definitely take that. We don't have an awful lot of... Um, patient. Yeah, we'll take those. I'm not going to read it though. Might be useful if you find um, a static NPC or an NPC uh, thingy. Majig. Yeah, a thingy Majig. Oops. Pepper scissors. Right, I think we should. We could still probably try and hack into this, probably. No. Alarm sounds. At least we got in this time. Unlock the door. Yep. Press any key. Unlock the door, press any key, and get inside. And what's in this one? Oh, that's unlocked door as well. Thorazine, Xanax, syringe, completely worth it. <laughs> completely worth it in every step of the... Oh, God. Oh, yeah, the alarm's going off, isn't it? So, Zeds are going to go, oh, what's over there? Is that a good... No, it's an improvement store. Well, considering there's no more turrets, I'm not really too bothered about... Uh, we can probably delete these. Just completely delete them. Park, pool, garage. I mean, we could definitely check out the garage anyway. On the way back. So now there's a few, there's a few other things that we can check out with the garage. Because it's still had a few other things. Oh shit, what am I doing? Oh, there we go. There's a Z. There's another Z. 
actually surprised this uh, knife is doing as well as I thought it would. Would be nice if I could try and learn um, something like Eskrim or um, Sillet now though. Obviously I'm not going to be able to just yet. I think we might have to get to the military outpost for that. Outpost. Right, metal tank. Uh, it hasn't actually got that much weight, it's just... Um, just awkward to carry, that's all. The tape there. Is there anything else? There's another wheel. Not really bothered about that. No. Well, there's a lot of stuff over it. Yeah, there was a lot of these tanks over here. There's a car battery, electric motor, steel frame. We'll take the electric motor. Solar panel? Yeah, please. I'll take that. Another torch, jumper cable. Uh, there's another torch. We'll take the wrench. Plastic jerry can. Uh, nothing else worth it. I'll take another thing for the time being. Okay, well that's uh, that's actually a decent sum. We've got a lot of stuff. Unfortunately, it's not quite what I'd hoped for, but um, we've got a majority of it, especially the uh, electric forge. That's going to save us a lot of materials and time as well, I must say. I mean, it just take quite a while to make the fucking forge. Oh yeah, there's the veggies, aren't they? Actually, yeah, let's get some more of those fucking fluid sacks, because those are good. Those are really good. I'll definitely take more of those. That's basically an unlimited supply of um, cooking oil right there. Well, not quite unlimited, but you know what I mean. It's going to give us a lot to work with. Let's kill this um, crawler zombie. He's probably already died about 16 million times. Oh, there was actually a normal pharmacy there. We'll have a quick look. At, we'll have a quick look in here and see what we can find. Hopefully, it's one of the newer variants because they usually have a lot of stuff behind the counter. Matchbook aspirin. Um, aspirin. Uh, it looks like it is. Yeah, it is. Fantastic. Let's go ahead and pick our way in. An alarm sounds. Fantastic. That's just what I wanted. Get in, you bastard. Get in, you bastard. And really, the only thing that's worthwhile doing here now is just pick it. Wow, really? Is that all I'm getting? There's uh, still quite a lot of stuff, but even so, it's still not that. Yeah, the only thing that's worthwhile doing now is trying to sort out basically a vehicle for us to uh, get out of here and I think that's I think that's definitely going to be our ne next objective there's not really much else I mean there's obviously there's a there's a lot more there's a lot more houses we can definitely check out I'm actually really tempted to do something actually I've always still got my I've still got my military rucksack on stupid thing you've been milling with your military rucksack on Dumbass. I'm very tempted to. Is that what I think it is? A remote vehicle controller. Well, okay. Haven't I have not checked? I haven't checked these bodies yet. Then, okay. I could just I already check check these bodies. Apparently, I haven't. Wow. Okay. Science ID card, I'll take those, I'll take the teleporter. Uh, I say not to a free teleporter. Or oh, barometer. Cool. Yeah. Wow, I'm actually surprised. I didn't realise I'd not picked uh, the stuff up from them. Weird. Oh, cargo spaces. That's always a nice find. Uh, we can probably um, carry one. No, we can't. We can't even do that. Oh, is that one of? Is that an RV? Is that an RV that that actually got stuff in it? Oh, it's a meth. It's a meth one. I would say it's an RV. What was wrong with it? No, I haven't actually come across this before. Oh, it needs a new engine. God damn it. Um, what do I need to remove that engine? 
you can't remove a part that's attached to it. Oh, you need to remove the alternator first. Well, let's do that anyway. And crash the game while we're at it. Right, now what do I need? I can actually get, I can actually remove that straight away. If I move that straight away and reinstall the. Um, where's it gone? Am I being a dumbass here? Where's it gone? Truck alternator, yeah. Let me reinstall the fucking truck alternator. Oh, maybe it needs to be attached to the. Uh, might be need to be attached to the thing. Oh, never mind. Well, we'll take that with us, and we'll take some of these lumps of steel as well, because they'll be really useful for crafting. And that's it. I haven't actually got anything else. So, uh, yeah, what I was going to do was have a look at the craters, and uh, hopefully, I can kind of get irradiated by it, so I can start mutating. That'd be really cool. But I'm not 100% sure if all craters um, will actually do that. I'm fairly sure they will. I don't know how long I've got to wait before um, I get irradiated. Might take a while. Yeah, I, I know there's a zombie there. I'm not really too fussed about that. Let me eat my other bicky. And let's wait. Let's wait um, four hours. Your radiation badge changes from green to blue. That's a good sign because it means I'm getting irradiated. You're feeling tired, stop waiting now. Alright. I wonder how, how bad I'm radiating now. Hmm. Let me. Where's my badge? Radiation badge. Can't do anything interesting with your radiation badge. You didn't want to. The film strip's blue. Okay, okay. Well, I'm irradiating now, so that's fantastic. Um, in fact, I can't actually tell if this is the irradiation kicking in from the. Um, but we'll soon see. Doesn't really matter at this point. Let's just get out of here. We are tired, so it's best we uh, leg it. Yeah, I'm pretty tired, as you can see. Uh, yeah, I'm also cold, which doesn't help. We definitely need to go indoors now. Really would be nice. Didn't I, type, didn't I put cargo there? Fang, you dumbass. Let's have it as pink. Cargo. Okay. Yeah, we definitely need to try and find a working vehicle. I mean, if I could install a new engine onto the uh, onto that RV, I didn't write down where the RV was, did I? Oh, thing, you dumbass! I knew I forgot something. Oh well, I'm not going to worry about it too much now. Now we just need to go ahead and sort out all this. So I'm going to obviously put a cut in here. In fact, we're 33 minutes in, so I'm going to put. I am going to put a cut in here, and. Uh, I don't know if this is going to actually end it for this particular recording session. I think it will. Um, I've got some stuff to do today, so I'll end the. Oh yeah, I'll end the session here. So okay then, guys. I'll see you next time.